Owl Temple 2, Electric Boogaloo. Except I'm pretty sure I've already said that. I swear I've already made that joke. I really honestly don't know at this point. It's fully possible that I already made the joke. Um, I wouldn't doubt it if I had already made the joke. So it's probably a bad idea that I make the joke again. But I also swear that I've... Oh, wait, hold on a second. I know exactly where the coins are. I was about to say I swear I don't actually know where the coins are. But no, I know exactly where they are. I know 100% without any doubt in my freaking mind exactly where those coins are. And they're a bit further in than I would like. But that's not a problem, really. Not for me. Because this entire area has been defeated by me before. And like I said, these are going to be... These are easy fellas now. For one, let's get some freaking food in me. Thank you. Now that I don't really have to deal with these fellas... Like, legitimately, I can do this. Because they come out of the walls. And, you know... I don't have to touch the eggs. I can just not. I can easily just not touch the eggs. There's always that option. I had never considered it before, but... Why am I doing this? Again, there's like such easier things to do here. And again, it's I know exactly where they are. I actually have a point in time where I know exactly where they where the collectibles are. And I've wasted everybody's time by creating this opening sequence. Not really an opening sequence, but like right here. I need something for that. And I think they're over up here maybe. No. Oh, yeah, they're at the top. <sighs> yeah. Also, I think up here? I mean, there shouldn't be anything up here of note. But in case there is... Why does that man... Oh, yeah, here's something of note. That's honestly probably most of them. Like, uh, let's see. Yeah, I mean, the last thing is probably going to be like a chest. Hey, look. Here we go. Or should I say, here we go. Here we go. Very gamer. And I am rich. Hi, rich. All right. <laughs> that was a lot quicker than I thought it would be. Namely because um, it's the Owl Temple. Not gonna lie, it's a relatively large area. And due to that, I figured I would actually have to do some searching too. Um, forgot, though did I, that um, I actually know exactly where the coins that you can't get through the first time are. So there is that, I don't have to get those. Only problem now is the floating continent, which I don't want to have to enter, but I will for the sake of c completion. It's kind of just what I do, I guess. Or, um, hold on. No, I actually do have to go. I know there's, um, there's an amount of there's a specific amount of coins for each area and you um you get the last thing by having more than are even counted in the count I guess but uh you actually do have to get a set amount from each area so there is that problem the fact that I don't have that set amount from each area yet is kind of the only problem So, for one, let's grab a bite to eat. Alright, there we go. Oh, no, no, this is important. Forgot that the area was around here. Let's just not fly. Why not? Why so? Never mind. So, yeah, cool thing about the floating... Con oh, God, there's a lot of... 
I do um, my homework on a desk, and I guess I press down with the pencil really hard because there's a lot of lead marks on the on the on the desk now. I suppose it's to be expected, but um, my bad, you know. This is my favorite button in the entire game. Skip cutscene. It, it's only that one. There is no other cutscene in this video game that you can skip. It's just the extremely long teleportation sequence. I don't even have an eraser that's good enough to get rid of these marks. Like, my, my eraser is... <laughs> I'm supposed to say pencil thin. But, um... <laughs> it's literally a pencil eraser, so... <laughs> yes, I am. Alright, fellas, we're moving backwards. Um, legitimately. I'm probably not actually going to spend all that much time here. But the jungle is significantly not as bad as the, um, what am I talking about? It's, it's not near as bad as, um, the Molten at least, so that, there's that. Oh cool, I don't even have to worry about some of this stuff. I mean, again, I, I'm not 100% on where exactly everything is. And I mean, welcome to the frickin' jungle, man. There's probably something that I couldn't even access beforehand because I didn't have Twig. That now I can access because I do, in fact, have Twig. This is something that is unnecessary. Really. I remember specifically going through this area multiple times just for there to be nothing because there is nothing up here. From up there came a rock. We are chased by the rock, and then it breaks down there. So I really am intrigued somewhat as to what I missed, and that was fun. Let's see, let's see, let's see it, let's see it. Oh, cool, didn't see that guy. Die. Thank you. Very do. I really do appreciate it, man. Thank you for dying. Did I, like, run past these guys or something? I didn't realize that you can't actually hit them as Twig, which is con inconvenient, seeing as Twig is kind of OP. Not gonna lie. Twig kind of OP like that, though. Can I move? Thank you. Very gamer. I'm sure there's not actually anything of use up here, though. I get the feeling that I have wasted everybody's time yet again. Uh, wouldn't it be nice if we were older? We wouldn't have to wait so long. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Oh, wait, hold on a second. I have Twig. Yeah. That's the name of the game here, honestly. To some extent. Die. Thank you. I say that way too much. It's just something I do, I guess. Hold up, I already have the thing from here. Very gamer. So what I'm assuming is there's something behind him. Or not? How odd is that? Why is that even here? It's like, what's the point? Be a lot cooler if there was. Uh, I don't think there are flies, though, so that's nice. They inability for things to actually blow up. Not blow up, but just kill me in general. This is a dead end. Or not. Thought it was, not gonna lie. Ow. Ow. Uh, ow. Uh. Okay, that was an accident, but you know, we don't have to talk about it.
Yeah. So about this area. I don't think there's any food here. Which sucks because food is kind of crucial to survival. But um... I guess I'll just not survive. There's always that option. Not gonna lie. Didn't I not even have Getty my first time through here? I get the feeling like that's a real thing that happened. Get out of here. There you go. <laughs> I really don't want to make this a two-parter, but I'm probably going to have to. I see what I did there. Have to. Anyway. Oh, hey, more. That's very good. For one, I move quicker. For two, I don't die. There's always that option. Not dying is a good thing, I gotta say. Nothing? Didn't I already go in there? Pretty sure I did. Let's, um, go in there again, just in case. Hey, look, nothing. Digital style. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're moving backwards today, folks. And I can do nothing about it. Yeah, no, I'm not going in there. I swear there was something there. At some point. I do not feel bad about this. Let's see if the light persists. Probably will not. But let's see it. Wait, this was just full of rings. I don't remember that. There's not really anything useful in here. Coin-wise, even. I doubt, just in general, anything in here. But hey, I got the freaking visibility buff. Let's see if I can actually make it through this maze. Oh, hey. You know, that might be it. There's enemies throughout the... Uh... Why is it blue? No. 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 Oh, dude, how did I not... Okay, hey, cool, guys. This isn't going to be a two-parter. Not sure how in all heck I didn't get that the first time, though. Okay, maybe it is going to be a two-parter. So I might have lied blatantly there. Okay, Pally, can you, like, do me a favor and not? Is there anything over here? Like, anything useful? Anything coiny? That's useful. I legit don't know if I'm going to find anything else. Okay, now I just feel dumb. There should be something else I want to say in this area. And if there isn't, I'm going to be sad and cry. And... and, <laughs> and I, I, I so badly want to make a joke that I'm just not allowed to say. <laughs> but, you know, let's just not worry about that right now. <laughs> it's probably something to do with this maze. At least that's what I want to say, but it's unlikely, seeing as even if there are enemies in the maze, what am I going to do about it, you know? I, I, I don't understand this area. Basically, the whole thing is very odd. But hey, let's just go through here again and lose all of my health. So why wouldn't I do that? That's why. That's why I have health down here. We are nearing the 20-minute mark, and I do not have the time that I would want to like edit this and then eat because I need to eat anything up here no I can't go up there 
Please, please, please let there be like any sign of something of use. I came from up here. Right? That was the whole shtick. No, I came from up there. Why am I here? Is it just to suffer? Just tell me that's something that I can reach. Wouldn't that be nice, huh? Too nice for me, I guess. Anything of relative importance down here? Besides you, you're going to die. I came up here already. Yeah, definitely. I remember getting stuck on that. Dude, where in all heck? It's going to be some place that I can't see in, which sucks because it, you can't see. Or maybe over here. Oh, you know, I can see that. Say goodnight. Something like that. I'm sad that I actually enjoy this game so much because there's a lot of things that I'm really confused about. Like where the last bit of couple of coins are. Couple of bits of coins are. Which sucks because again, it's a really good game. But I don't want to have to play it for this long because there's no benefit to doing it for this long. And this is something that I can't even access right now. I don't think it's something that I could ever really access, apparently. I need a rock for it or something. So where's the secret passage that I haven't found, you know? Where's the thing? <laughs> where's, where's the thing? Where's the enemy I haven't killed? Show me. Where? And wouldn't it be wonderful if I just figured something out really quick? In a in a very small amount of time that can be easily processed and put into a consumable block. Instead I've been sitting here for something like ten minutes just in this area, just flying around for no reason. Can't even find anything. So maybe I'll go over here next. Hey, look, nothing. That guy's stuck. Uh, that's pretty funny. Again, I already killed everything in this area, so what's the point? At least you don't have to deal with monkeys. That's fun. It's probably, it's definitely something in this area now. That, and now that I'm talking about it, now that I'm here, now that I know that I've already looked overlooked this area, it's definitely something here. Why wouldn't it be? It's just not the enemies. It couldn't be. Of course. Did that bring me up? No. There's nine more. Which would be about three coupon rings. How is it only nine more? Come on, come on, come on. Come on, you. There's so many areas that look like they would be spaces to hide something. They're just not. Which sucks because, um, wouldn't it be wonderful if they were hiding something like three coupon rings? Because that would bring me up to the full sum total of the entire game. Hey, look, wow. Yep. That's all of them. Yep. Almost. I have 2980 
Or, I have 2890, right? Yeah, 2890. For whatever reason, I got to 2908 in one of my other files, but I'm not going to worry about those. They aren't important. Um, on the next episode, we are caching those in, and then we are going to enter space. Like, comment, and subscribe, or I will make you enter space. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.